Hi kindergarten, today is lesson 37 and we're going to be talking about something brand new. What do you see in front of you? This right here is a line of numbers and sometimes we call that a number line. A number line is where we put all of the numbers side by side in order. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's in order of smallest to largest. One is the smallest. Ten is the largest number on this line. So we're going to practice using this line. I just made it a little cuter. But we're going to practice using this line to actually add and subtract. I know it sounds pretty weird, but I think you're going to like it. So let's say I have the number five, and I want to add three more. Can you think to yourself, what's five plus three? Think about it. What's five plus three? How can we solve that? Well, we could draw five circles and then draw three more circles, but sometimes it's actually easier to use a number line, and I'll show you how we do it. We add three, we make three jumps. Watch this. One, two, three. We landed on the number eight. Let's double check. If I have five and I add one, two, three more, how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, five, six, seven, eight. Five and three jumps takes us to eight. So if we wanted to match a number sentence, we would say five plus three more equals eight. That's really cool. Do you wanna try another one? Okay. What if I say I already have eight and I wanna take three away? I will put the arrows in the opposite direction. Watch this, eight, Taking away one, two, three. So one, two, three. That takes me back to five because if I have eight and I take three away, one, two, three, we only have five left. Eight take away three is five. Wow. I wonder if we can try this with different numbers. Do you think this will work for all addition and subtraction problems? If you want to write down a numbered line like this and practice, you can. We're going to talk a little bit more about this tomorrow. But remember, all we have to do is jump over the number we want to add. One, two, three. Five plus three equals eight. When we're taking away, we just go backwards. Eight, one, two, three, leaves us with five. So this is a super cool new skill, and I'm excited to get to work on it with you all later. Great job, kindergarten.